Alan Foster, who co-founded the Big Baller brand, is dragging the Ball family to court once again. This time, he's suing Laval Ball, Tina Ball, Lamelo Ball, as well as Puma, alleging they screwed him out of hundreds of millions of dollars. Foster's claims were spelled out in a new lawsuit in federal court in California earlier this week. Four years after he had a falling out with the Ball family over the Big Baller brand business. In the lawsuit, Foster says as part of his role at Big Baller brand, he helped develop Lamello's brand. Foster alleges he came up with an MB1 line for the Charlotte Hornets point guard when the Hooper was just a teenager. And then he filed for several trademarks for it. Foster claims it all eventually led to the creation of Melo's first signature shoe, the MB1, which he says was highly successful. However, he claims a few years later, in an attempt to push him out of the company, Laval Ball created a second version of Big Baller brand and tried to transfer over Foster's trademarks to cut him out of the huge profits from the successful brand. In addition, Foster says when Melo ultimately signed a shoe contract with Puma, the basketball player and the apparel company infringed on his trademarks when they created their new signature shoe, the MB.01. In the lawsuit, he said, and I quote, Lamelo was instrumental in creating his first signature shoe with Big Baller brand. He was fully aware of the existence of the Lamello trademarks because he helped design them. He continued saying he knew that his Big Baller brand signature shoe was called the MB1 and that the name was protected by a federal trademark. Yet, despite his knowledge of all this, Lamello woefully and deliberately chose to name the signature shoe he created and designed with Puma the MB1 in violation of the Lamello trademarks. Alan Foster alleges the damages he sustained over it all exceed $200 million. Damn. So yeah, that's what's going on in the mellow ball side of things. Let me know what you think in the comments down below.